This is the video review for Transformers Movie Leader Class Brawl. As you can see, he's a tank. Um, kind of got a green camouflage pattern painted on him. Um, you will know, he doesn't have his batteries in him. I took him out and haven't put him back in. Um, but he wouldn't make cannon noises. These cannons would light up in the tip of this. These light up green, and I believe this lights up red. Um, you'll notice I have painted the... Uh, these would be clear plastic normally. I painted them black, but I did leave the fronts of them. It's hard to tell here, but I did leave the fronts of them clear. So if you were to fire them, you would still see the LEDs. But then they but they don't look quite as out of place as the so just the clear plastic ones. Um, the turret does rotate on this, and uh, this turret rotates independently. And the cannon can be raised and lowered a few degrees. And we can position these kind of, but they're on springs, they tend to pop back into place. Um, for comparison size and tank mode, here he is next to uh, movie Bumblebee. Um, it's about near as I can figure, that's actually probably a fairly accurate scale, but I, do, I don't have this tank next to this car to, I don't have any pictures of it to, to confirm that. But just guessing on how big a person would be in comparison, I would assume that's, that's it. close to actual scale. Um, probably not exact, but close. Um, transformation. Start off, you just want to you push these tank lights, and you'll see the side panels automatically flip back some. And from there, you can uh, pull, undo this and fold this panel all the way down. And same here. Pull this panel and unpop it. Pop it from here and fold it down. Um, you can fold these pieces out and pull the arms out to the sides like so. And we're going to fold these tread pieces in and push this whole assembly. Um, pull them back. Pull the treads toward you a little bit so that this notch right here goes into this groove right up here the whole thing should snap together you turn to rotate and you can also see there's a clip tab here that clips into the back of that when everything is done right and that locks everything solidly into place so we'll do that over here um, if you want you want to rotate them out at the knees this is the forward facing position and then open up his feet like so he does have some ankle swivels to help position him. Again, flip out the front piece and flip out the back piece. And that is transformation for the lower half of Brawl. So let's go on up here and focus on the upper half. This arm, um, actually there's a There's a button there that automorphs his head. I forgot to un unattach this. If you pull the turret back up and then flip these tank treads up and this whole assembly, chest assembly, once you get the arms out, the uh, whole top can flip down into place. Position those however you like. And then the back, the turret rotates around like this. Oh, maybe this way. And plugs in. And then this side panel right here pops off, and you can pull the gun out. Or just pull it all the way off. Um, like that. Oh, I just broke it. Genius. Well, normally this would not break like that. I'll fix it when I get home. Um, but then you pull this turret up to the side here. And then this piece snaps back into place. And then the turret can either rotate out to point forward, or I usually just leave it hanging down to the side in the back because it just gets in the way. And the arms are just a simple matter of rotating them down so the gold's in front. Rotating them around at the shoulder swivel. This gun flips up and around and snaps onto his forearm like that. 
you can open up his pose his fingers. And then if you slide this forward, the cannon extends and the sight pops up. And then this arm, same thing. Rotate it so the gold's on the front. And then you normal I think it's rotated during transformation, but you rotate it around so that's facing forward. Cannon on this side also rotates up and snaps. Um, you can flip up a Gatling gun, kind of a machine gun there on, on his arm, as well as if you slide this piece for backwards, um, blades pop up. And again, he's got the posable fingers over here. And then on the back, this separate cannon tank, or turret, rotates all the way up. And these pieces right here can be split to come up and rotate around up over his shoulders. So from the front it becomes a very heavily armored tank. I mean, he's got pretty good articulation. He's got shoulders forward and ratchets, um, swivel here. Um, he does have the, uh, you can move his wrists in and out some, and he does have the posable fingers. Um, ratchets it forward into the sides at the waist, or at the hips, uh, mid-thigh swivel, forward and backward knees, um, and he does have the uh, posable ankles there. And his head does turn, although he can't really see anything other way because of the treads. But there you have Transformers movie leader class brawl.